continuation of the previous video on the Prochura, minute soft body and pigmented apterigota having ectognathus, I'm sorry, endognathus piercing mouth part, but no eyes, sosilla, antennae, and sersae. <coughs> and the terminal 11th abdominal segment with a median telson. Habitat, they occur in moist soil, peat, woodland, litter turf, under stones and beneath dwarf. Distribution cosmopolitan over 200 species. Characters, they are minute whitish insects. 0.5 to 2.5 mm long. Head prognathus. Pyriform and narrow anteriorly. <coughs> then mouth parts. Piercing sucking type. Labium, mandibles and maxillae are modified into paired stylates withdrawn in the gnathal pouches. Labrum is pointed out vestigial while hypofadding is present. Superlingui absent. Antenna absent or reduced into fine tubercles with reduced pronotum, which one thorax. So legs long with one segmented tarsi with a single claw. The forelegs are long, sensory and function as antennae. Then abdomen slender and long. In newly hatched insects, it is composed of eight segments. While three more segments besides telson are added during post-embryonic mouths representing Anamorphosis. Each first three abdominal segments carry a pair of appendages. Then sursae absent while thalsin is present. Prochira. So in external genital unit developed behind the 11th segment. Male and female consist a pair of stylets. Male has two gonopoles in the 11th segment while the female bears only a single gonopole. Then malpigian tubules represented by six minute papillae. Cephalic glands. There are two pairs of maxillary and a pair of labial glands. Then tracheal system. Absent except in esentomidae and synentomidae, provided with only two pairs of spiracles. Miso and metathoracic, but without intersegmental tracheal communication. Nervous system consists of brain, focused subesophageal, prothoracic ganglion, miso metathoracic ganglia, and six abdominal ganglia. Then endocrine glands, there is a single corpora cardiaca and a pair of corpora, corpora alata. Female reproductive system consists of a pair of ovaries, oviduct and vagina. Ovary represents a single panoistic ovary, there is a single female gonopora. Male reproductive system, testis has, there is a pair of elongate sacs united anteriorly, also differentia open independently through a pair of male gonopores. Then classification under Protura consists of about 200 species. The species are divided into two sub super families. Esentomoidia and Acerentomoidia. The superfamily Esentomoidia consists of the families Esentomidae and Sinentomidae. While other superfamily Acentomoidae consists of families Protentomidae and Acerentomidae. The family Sinentomidae is confined into China, while other families are widely distributed. Common families. Esentomidae. It is characterized by presence of trachea and spiracles and two segmented three pairs of abdominal appendages like Esentomoid. Then Protendomidae. It is characterized by absence of trachea and spiracles and only two pairs of abdominal appendages are two segmented. Then Acerentomidae. No trachea and spiracles. Only first pair of abdominal appendages are two segmented. Then order columbola or spring tails. Apterigota with endognathus biting mouth part, six segmented abdomen and with a springing apparatus. But without compound eyes, tracheal system, alpigian tubules, external genital and sursae. They occur under stone, soil, decaying vegetables among garbage, bark of trees on fresh or marine water in termite nests, etc. Distribution cosmopolitan characters body covered with hairs and scales, pigmented white, grey, green, or black. Head pro or hypognathus. Antennae four segmented, variable in length, bearing receptors on the last two segments, modified as gripping organs in the male smithridae. Then ocelli occur in variable numbers, stomata, but only up to eight on each side. A pair of ring or rosette like post. Antennal organs function as the chemoreceptors. Then mouth parts elongated and sunk in head cavity. Piercing, sucking or biting, chewing type. Mandibles monocondylic, slender with two extremities and rotary movements. 
palpi vestige super lingui well developed lamellae structures about the hypopharynx and labrum will distinct but labium is degenerated then thorax these three segmented but pro thorax reduced legs equal in size without tibio tarsal joint with a pair of claws or one maybe vestigial or absent trochanter with a hairy trochanterial organ abdominal composed of only six segments then abdominal appendages first abdominal append segment with a ventral tube functioning as a respiratory osmoregulatory or other sub organ fourth abdominal segment bears a jumping organ or furca third abdominal segment bears a pair of retinaculum or hamula external genital absence sursa absence cephalic glands one or two pairs of salivary glands present a pair of labial nephridia present nervous system with a brain subesophageal and three thoracic ganglia free abdominal ganglia are lacking and are fused with the meta thoracic ganglia corpora alata are well developed heart a six chambered structure malpighian tubule totally veiny fat body it function as excretory organ tracheal system trachea absent in poduridae but smithridae with a pair of spiracles in between head and prothorax trachea of head thorax and abdomen remain unbranched and separate the reproductive system the testes and ovaries are paired but not sac like structures with the aureoles or testicular follicles no accessory glands male or female gonopus with fifth abdominal segment metamorphosis absent molting occurs even after retaining sexual maturity maturity is attained after 4 or 7 molts columbola consists of <coughs> 1500 species These are grouped into sub two suborders: Arthropleona and Symphypleona. So, columbola consists about one thousand five hundred species. They are grouped into two suborders: Arthropleona and Symphypleona. Then, classification: Pogeridae, Hypogonad. Thuridae, Nianuridae, Onikiridae, Isotomidae, Endomobraeidae, Tomoseridae, Nelidae, Smithridae, and Dictyomidae. Next, Order Epimeroptera, Mayflies. The amphibiotic exopteric ota with aquatic long-lived limbs and terrestrial very short-lived adults. Limbs bear chewing, biting type of mouth parts and metameric seven pairs of abdominal tracheal gills. While adults possess vestigial mouth parts and abdominal abdomen with long cirrhi and frequently a median caudal filament. The wings are held vertically over the thorax at rest. Habitat: the adults are four mm to 50 mm or less than 1 cm long and found near ponds streams lakes and rivers they are amphibiotic the limbs are aquatic and long lived even up to 3 years while adults are terrestrial having a very short life of only a few hours they are characterized by large number of nymph instars the last instar nymph molts first into subimago form underwater bearing delicate cuticle translucent wings and marginal frames of Yes, the sub-imigo then molds into imigo with fully grown eyes, legs, transparent wings, pigmented or rough cuticle and functional spiracles. The adult mayflies are mostly nocturnal in habitat. habit. Head the prognathus with freely articulate with the thorax and knee short and cetaceous. Compound eyes often larger in males than females and are differentiated into upper division bearing large facets and lower division bearing small facets. Ocelli three situated between the compound eyes, mouth parts in adult flies, trophid, and degeneration starts in the late stage of last instar nymph and as a result, mandibles are vestigial or veiny. Maxillae are represented by palps and labium by post mentum bearing a pair of distal lobes and small palps. The adults are incapable of feeding. The mouth parts in nymphs are well developed. They include strong mandibles, maxillae, labium with three segmented palps. Four labelled lingula and a distinct hypothorax with a pair of large superlingui. They are herbivorous and feed upon plant detritus, algal growth, etc. Thorax characterized by a large mesothoracic segment, while the pro and meta thoracic segments are comparatively very small. The four wings are larger than hind ones. The latter are sometimes greatly reduced or even absent. 
they are triangular membranous and fragile the four wings are characterized by the presence of large number of longitudinal veins cross veins and intercalary veins the intercalary veins are the branches of long veins but they are they have lost their basal connections and are connected with long veins by cross veins and are mostly appearing as the marginal veins the auxiliary sclerites are typical and may flies cannot flex their wings over the abdomen at rest and the wings are therefore kept often in vertical position The legs unsuitable for walking weak, longer in males and females and are often used for grasping the female during copulation. Tarsi are five segmented but may reduce to one or two segments. Pre-tarsus with a pair of claws, one may be regenerated or blunt. Abdomen, external genital, tracheal gills, cerci, digestive system and other points are also important. Like abdomen, slender, ten segmented, and eleventh segment is reduced and fused with ten segment. While its target of an extensive median caudal filament, the male conopus appears lying in between seventh and eighth abdomen and sterna. External to the interior, an appendicular oviposter is absent except the libido. The file may be. The male genital consists of a pair of claspers and a pair of penis, fused basally. Tracheal gills. The nymphs bear seven pairs of. plate like or filamentous abdominal tracheal gills on the first seven segments they are major respiratory and osmoregulatory organs the first pair of gills is vestigial and remaining are biramous consisting of a pair of lamellae provided with long filaments which are penetrated by tracheoles then so say paired long and multi articulated filaments then digest the system in nymphs it is well developed and consists of large midgut and numerous malpighian tubules in adults the alimentary canal is fully filled with air and serves the aerostatic function <coughs> the midgut is modified into a sort of hair sac with a regeneration of epithelium and muscular coat then male reproductive system consists of a pair of ovoid sac like testes and female reproductive system consists of a pair of ovaries and composed of a large number of panoistic ovules and oviducts of both ovaries open separately the female accessory glands are lacking spiracles there are two pairs of thoracic and eight pairs of abdominal spiracles and all are functional heart is composed of 10 chambers and in the heart region it extends as an aorta then metamorphosis during post embryonic development diapause may occur mating often occurs during sperm heptagenidae Beetle, Cephalorhynidae, and some other families are also there. Tomorrow we are going to once again learn this, and later we will be learning about order odonata or damselflies, dragonflies group. Thank you.